Obviously, fall's an ideal time to tee it up in the Midwest. Our Dave Lockhart recently took a road trip up north to the Upper Peninsula of Michigan for an adventure filled with sightseeing and spectacular golf. This is known as Uper Country, and in the small, friendly town of Marquette stands two diverse courses at the Marquette Golf Club. The first is the pleasant and traditional heritage course originally laid out by the outstanding design team of Lankford and Morrow in 1926. Some 80 years later, architect Mike DeVries unearthed gray walls on the hills high above the shores of Lake Superior. Known for his minimalist and naturalist style, DeVries walked the property for three months in the middle of the winter in order to route this masterpiece. He didn't want to disturb anything on the property if he couldn't get by with it, and he did. And um, so he used all those rock formations for his, to outline his holes, outline his green complexes, things like that, and strategically, strategically placed them. So it makes it a lot of fun. And it looks like it's totally natural out there. It looks like it's been there a thousand years, not just for six. Gray Walls is currently ranked number two in the state of Michigan for courses that you can play by Golf Week Magazine. This track is chock full of dynamic views and will test every aspect of your game. I mean, everybody sees it for the first time and it's just, it is a wow, you know, it's just like, oh my God, you know, and something totally unique for the Midwest. Uh, very dynamic uh, piece of land, a uh, lot of rock formations, great vistas of Lake Superior, some valley holes, a couple streams running through it. There's a lot going on in 18 holes of golf out there. Just outside the town of Iron Mountain stands Timberstone at Pine Mountain. This terrific Jerry Matthews design was carved right out of a dense, rugged forest. Timberstone is a very fair golf course. Uh, there aren't uh, many, if any, blind shots out here. So you can always see where you want the ball to land. We do have four sets of tee boxes. So whichever tee box you choose will really determine how well you play that day. It's really a, a great spot, like I said earlier, to get away and really see nature. Uh, most of the people that come out here have some sort of interaction with white-tailed deer. And I think coming from the city, you know, you don't see that too often, so that really takes them back. And another thing that's great about the Upper Peninsula of Michigan is Picture Rock State Park up here in the northern end of Upper Peninsula of Michigan. And this is just beautiful, relaxing, breathtaking, and something you really must see and check out. Yes, this is Lake Superior, the cleanest of the Great Lakes. It practically reminds one of the California coast in Carmel. In the middle of the UP lies a one-stop resort that has it all. The Island Resort and Casino features Sweetgrass, a Paul Albanese prairie-style course that epitomizes pure Michigan. Well, Sweetgrass, it's a, it has a lynx appearance. Um, fescue framing in all the fairways. Uh, doesn't really have the pot bunkering like a true links course does. It's you know standard bunkering, uh, very generous fairways, uh, very playable, uh, well received by golfers. Uh, it's very playable off the tee. Uh, difficulty comes in the greens and chipping. You know around the green. Conditioning reigns supreme on this vast layout that sprinkles in imagination. For instance, there's an island green which can play considerably longer than the TPC's famous hole. There's also a giant Redan green, which hails from the Scottish origins of the game. Plus, the 9th and 18th share a massive putting surface that is in the shape of Upper Michigan. The name Sweetgrass is an actual Native American medicine that could be found right on the property. The, the great part about Sweetgrass is the reason it's used, it's used for when people come together and they're gonna have a meeting, so to speak, or a council and it's used to clear your mind of bad thoughts and only let in good thoughts. A golfer needs that. Golfers also need a place like the Island Resort and the solitude of this design, which Golf Week places as one of the top 25 casino courses in America. I think the best part about it is it's a getaway. If you're from somewhere, a larger city or a community, it's a getaway. It, it, it's peaceful, it's calm, the people are nice, the locals are nice people. So, I mean, it's really, if you want to get away from it all and enjoy yourself and calm down, this is the place to do it. The island also hosts the world-class showroom featuring talents ranging from Wayne Newton to the band Daughtry.